Sir, uh, it's my pleasure to have you here, Professor Sarwar Alam, uh, Muhammad Sarwar Alam, HOD of uh, Chemistry Department of Jamia Hamdard University, New Delhi. And uh, it is a very great occasion that such a great scientist uh, is with us here. And uh, we are uh, just, uh, just now uh, uh, doing some uh, experiments, basic understanding about the uh, this uh, device which is before you and this device is uh, named as a uh, service meter since it is commercialized by a reputed company and uh, this uh, uh, surface tension, viscosity, wetting coefficient, particle size, frequency, these are very prominent physicochemical properties of an example. So sir, uh, uh, what do you think, uh, what is your opinion about this device which is before you, uh, whether it may be really a breakthrough or really maybe some useful, maybe saving some resources, maybe inspiring the users and all respected sir, I would like to have your comments. Uh, first of all, uh, I would like to congratulate you for the wonderful invention that you have carried out. Uh, and the name is befitting. You have named this equipment as service meter, surface tension viscosity meter. Yes, and uh, at one go, you can measure the surface tension as well as the viscosity of uh, any given liquid. And uh, I have already gone and see, I have already seen the demo of this equipment and uh, to my surprise what I found was that the accuracy and precision of this uh, instrument is so close that it was perhaps unbelievable for me to think that any Indian scientist could achieve this uh, success and uh, Borosil company has uh, been working on it perhaps why fine because the calibration work that has been carried out they must have put a lot of efforts to come up finally with this uh, uh, design with this uh, feature with the feature that is present in this equipment i think that it is a must for any msc or bsc lab in any university of india and uh, all the colleges all the, uh, not only colleges or the uh, different MSc labs, but I feel that even the research labs in different universities can have a lot of benefits by using them and appropriately using them uh, for uh, their experiment, for their various experiments. And uh, this will go a long way uh, in uh, Indian's achievement, something done by an Indian scientist and that to Professor Man Singh. Uh, I feel that uh, uh, this equipment will not only help in saving a lot of time because you can carry out the measurement of viscosity as well as surface tension as well as uh, uh, what you call as IFT uh, at a time. And uh, if you carry out, for example, the viscosity and surface tension using two different equipments, uh, that doesn't that uh, not only saves time, but or that has a uh, demerit of using uh, different equipments and washing them and cleaning them and using them at a different point of time. So this, in that way, is going to be a very very important and very very beneficial equipment for any. Uh, lab maybe for BSc or maybe for MSc and uh, I would also recommend that even the researchers doing research in the level of PhD should be able to use this lab to the best of their ability. I think I'm more than satisfied with this kind of uh, equipment coming out from any Indian scientist.